All right, for those of you that don't know, me and Brewer did a show for Machinima called Happy Hour Saloon, a show about a 43-year-old alcoholic that brings his nephew to a bar to talk about video games. And because of that, in 2014, I was on a panel at San Diego's Comic-Con to talk about internet animation. Now, what do I know about internet animation? Well, you're looking at it. Jack shit, for the most part. I just know stick figures and poop jokes. Why the hell would I be on a panel at Comic-Con? I'm not famous. Nobody knows who the hell I am. Uh, uh hello, hello everybody. everybody. I, work I work at a, at a car, car dealership. dealership. In Ohio. in Ohio. Anybody, Anybody want, my, want autograph? my autograph? But whatever. It's a free trip to Comic-Con. Me and Brewer figured, why the hell not? So we fly out there. We got to meet the Power Rangers and this guy that's starting a Nicolas Cage religion. But then it was time to do this goddamn animation panel. So I'm up there, sitting next to real animators, people that have actually done shit with their life. I got security guards yelling at me and shit. Hey, you can't sit up there. Uh, no, I'm supposed to be up here. Are you sure? Uh, I don't know. So throughout the whole panel, I pretty much just sit there with my thumb in my ass while nobody asks me any questions. Uh, yeah, this one's for the guy in blue. Uh, who are you and what the fuck are you doing here? So after the panel, there was an after party at a bar that everybody went to. Now, were we invited to the party? I don't know, probably not, but we went anyways. All we knew was that it was an open bar, so we had a drink in each hand at all times. We're totally out of place there. There's people in suits, all dressed up, looking all fancy. Me and Brewer are standing in the corner with our band t-shirt looking like Oliver Twist and shit. Do you smell that? It smells like poor people out here. There's people talking to me about buying condominiums and shit. I'm over there like, oh, that's cool. I overdrafted my checking account three times this month. Brewer's over there trying to teach people where we're from. Ohio? Never heard of it. After drinking for a while, I was pretty drunk. But Brewer, on the other hand, he was uncomfortably drunk. He's over there just making shit up, telling everybody we're a gay couple. Oh, yeah, we're super gay together. <laughs> that's just, uh, that's just a joke. Oh, he's so shy. Look at him. He's my little honey bear. Okay, time to leave. So we leave the bar, and I have to practically teach Brewer how to walk again. He's laying down in a parking lot. Just leave me here. The Power Rangers will save me. Somehow, we get onto the bus that takes people back to their hotels. So we sit down, and all of a sudden, Brewer's looking pretty shitty. I think I'm gonna throw up all over the place. Uh, well, you better not. We're on a bus. Okay, I won't. Blech. Brewer just throws up all over himself like a newborn baby. And then, he throws up a little bit more. Blech. Oh, sick. Is somebody fucking puking on the bus? People start freaking out. They start running outside like the bus is on fire. Oh god, it smells like half-digested tequila in here. There's puke all over the floor. The whole bus smells like a Kmart. Nobody wants to stay on here, but we have to stay on here because our hotel is like two miles away. So now it's just me, Brewer, a pile of puke, and the now super pissed off bus driver. Goddamn Ohio kids. Go back to your made-up fairy tale land, you stupid assholes. Finally, we get to our hotel. And as a bonus, while I'm standing up, I accidentally put my hand in some of Brewer's throw up. Oh, sick! Blech. Oh, god damn it! We're walking off the bus. Brewer's got the audacity to say something to the bus driver. You have a good night, sir. Oh, yeah, I'm sure I will now that you threw up all over the goddamn place like a fucking Olsen twin. We walk into the hotel lobby. Brewer's got his shirt off like somebody's drunk relative. We're standing in the elevator. People are staring at us and shit. Why doesn't he have a shirt on? Uh, it's fine. We're just, uh, we're super gay together. Yeah, that's it. And that was the end of our trip to Comic-Con. We both survived, and the next morning, we flew back to Ohio, wherever the fuck that is, and we never been to Comic-Con since. BrewStew.com